Pilotron. It's actually a new entry experience solution. Let's assume that you're at a game or you're going to an amusement park, you would have your entry ticket and you would walk up to the machine and you would scan your card and that would be your entrance. You don't have to show that to anybody else. And you would open the door and place your bag in and close the door and walk through to the other side. And on the other side, the bag is going to be waiting for you. And if there's a green door, then everything is wonderful. And then you will scan again your ticket so that you're the only person who can open that door. Nobody else can come and open that door and take your bag. You'll open it, take your bag, and go. So let's say it's a venue that doesn't allow you to bring water in, and so we need to stop the water. Then that door will turn purple, and it will tell you to wait a moment. And then the guard will ask you, did you bring water when you're not supposed to bring water? and have you take your water bottle out and you'll go. So that's a process that can take about 10 seconds, where if it's an airport, that can be a minute to two minutes, and if you're having a manual search of a, of a large bag properly, that could, that could be 30 seconds. I think the major challenge is anything when you do something that's so new, and you're really turning upside down the way that a security is being done or looked at, then there's your standard challenges of finding those who are the leaders who adopt something that's new. So actually from the past 18 months, we've been in a field testing uh, mode. And it's been across four different venue types, an airport, stadium, monument. And we have the ability to have five people go through at the same time in a much, much smaller space. We can get a lot of people through. Um, a lot more quickly in the fact that people don't need to take anything out of their bags. Then the responses have been just, oh my goodness, nobody's touching my stuff. People from other countries knew how to use it intuitively because pretty much where you go, green is go, red is stop, so it's so easy and intuitive. So um, the model that we tested in the field trials, those are the models that are going to be coming out um, for general availability in early 2014.